No weakness there. No doctors there. There's no hospitals there. There's no psychologists there. There's no medicine cabinets there. There's no arthritis over there. <laughs> Wherefore, comfort one another with these words. Comfort. Comfort. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Heaven's Jubilee. Heaven. Heaven. Hang on, my friend. Don't worry. You need to save yourself from this untoward generation. Just as in the days of Noah, so shall it be when the Son of Man cometh. People caught outside the ark, doubting. There's, there's people in the world right now doubting truth, doubting the Bible. Is it really true? Does it really matter what you believe? Does it really matter how you're baptized? Does it really matter... That we are faithful? Does it really matter that we're holy? Does it really matter that we try to live a godly life? That we dress modestly? That we do things in accordance to what He would have us to do? God, let us our works, O Lord. Let it please You today. The world doubted Noah, but it didn't stop anything. I don't know how much time we have, but I felt that God laid this upon my heart today. Look up. Your redemption cometh. Look unto the hills for which cometh our help. Our help cometh from the Lord. I come as a thief in the night, catching you unaware. Heaven's point of view. Heaven's point of view. Jesus. Speak into our hearts today, Lord. Every head bowed, every eye closed. I know that there are those of you that have maybe tried to work it out your own way. Be careful of that. Does it what matter man's opinion say about you is what God says about you. Come on, it's not time to wait any longer. Those on the world wide web that's listening right now, we need to let you know that God is coming. He's coming soon. It's not time to say, well, I need to get to church. I need to do this. I need to do that. No, you need to get up from where you are, run to the altar, and say, God, let your mercy cover me. Let your blood set me free. Jesus, help us today. doesn't matter how far you've gone, where you've been, what you've been into. His mercy still today. There will come a day, though, when someone will try to get into the church and we won't be here. The doors will be locked forever. Let me in. Let me in. Come today, those who are weak, weary, and heavy laden. I will give you rest. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for your truth. Is there anyone who would like to come today? Sister Dozier made her way to the front. One of these days she'll lay down that heavy burden. Hatalo shati la baha. Hidalalabo shatalalaha. 
Those that hunger and thirst after righteousness shall be filled. Those that are lethargic, Laodicean, you will find your oil spilt and spent when the bridegroom cometh and you will have no more oil in your lamp. Heaven's point of view. Heaven's point of view. Heaven's point of view. It's not a figment of your imagination. It's real. There's a real heaven. Wherefore, comfort one another with these words. Comfort, 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 comfort. Let's find ourselves a place to pray. That will be when my Jesus Jesus I shall see see when I look look upon His face the one who saved me by by His grace grace, when when He takes me with you today as we leave this place. The Christians who did the most for this present world are those who thought the most about the next world. What we lay up in heaven, the thief and the robber can't break in and destroy. We need to work on this earth preaching, teaching, singing, heaven, home Bible studies, outreach, testimony, tracts, CDs. We need to get the Word of the Gospel in the hands of those that are lost. I'm telling you, those who did the most in their world thought the most about heaven. Heaven is a place. Heaven, I want to go. Heaven.